Tommy, final home game of the season. It's flown by really, hasn't it? What are your thoughts ahead of this one? Yeah, we're really looking forward to it. We've you know, we had a really good experiences all season for the vast majority of the home games. Um, we expect the East Bank to be full. Um, so we're really looking forward to, like you said, the last game of the, the regular season. Preparations were already going to be a bit skewered this week, but obviously we take out the game that we were supposed to play on the Tuesday night and it's been even more skewered. So not ideal preparation, but I guess nothing we haven't seen already this season when you have the busy Easter and Christmas mm. schedules and stuff. Yeah, I mean, nobody wants games called off. Us, as much as Gay said, didn't want the game called off. However, the people that make the decisions are the people that make the decisions. There's nobody else involved in that. I believe that the football club, has any football club, has a duty of care uh, to, to act correctly on the days leading into the game. Listen, the River Tyne hasn't burst its banks more than twice in 70 years and it burst its banks at the early part of the week. It's a mile from Gateshead, the water table's up. It just wasn't a, a, a possibility. It's nothing we can do about that. Trust me, we didn't want to travel all the way up there and not play a football match. So we have to go there next week and there's no, no harm done in that respect. You know, we're all well for the for the experience of visiting God's country and um, we go back there next Wednesday now. And looking ahead to this weekend's one, it's another game against one of those sides that's, you know, at the other end of the table, but the points for them mean just as much as they do for us, so it's, a, it's definitely another difficult one. We've just had a chat with the lads before we've gone out to train there about the importance of the game for both teams, really. I mean, at the end of the day, I, I say every week to you that's our most important game because it's my next one, you know, and, and that's the case. It's no good me talking about if this and what if that and if they do this. It doesn't matter. It's about what we do on the day and it'll be what Boreham would do on, on the day. And like you said, both teams need the points for different reasons. Um, but at the end of the day, it is another game. There's not six points on it. There's three points on it. And we'll try and take the three if we can. Uh, and if we if we don't, then we'll try and take what we can from the game. But I think we'll go into their stronger in terms of numbers we've had a few lads return to train this week because of the the break really and the game in that respect has probably made us a little bit stronger numbers wise for the last three games yeah i think what you said there was very true isn't it it's, it's about what we do that's all that we can affect so go on saturday give a good performance and a good account of ourselves and and that's yeah. all we can do yeah i mean if this is to be our last home game of the season which it, it, it will be um i want the fans to go home after that game thinking, you know what, that's how they've played all season. And if we can give it our best version of ourselves, I'll be happy, whatever their outcome. Um, I think that, what is it, a year and two weeks since I've been at the football club, we're in a different place. The group mentality, the club focus and the fans and the support that we've had is just a different animal, you know, and uh, I'm looking forward to seeing that, like I said, the East Bank full. TNT Sports cameras here, of course. A, a nice experience for us in front of those mm. last time against uh, Altrincham. So hopefully more of the same of that one, I guess. Yeah, they haven't, I'm surprised they haven't been to us a little bit more often this season. We are, you know, if you look at the goals for and against Colin, we're probably up there with most. Mm. So uh, whilst I want it to be an entertaining game, I'll take a scruffy 1-0 if you give it me now. Um, but yeah, that, that all adds to it. Yeah, of course, we'll get a little bit longer in bed, which is required because of the trip that we did without, without a game in the middle. So yeah, it's slightly different and we won't be able to hide the fact that all the other results will have come in and we'll know what the score is, if you like. Um, but it won't change our focus. Like I said, we've we've planned from the moment that the Gearsid game was off, we planned on the, the Boreham Wood game. So that's all our focus is. <laughs>